All right, what's up, people, man? Y'all see the title, man? It's going to sound like some real unbelievable-ish from the title stating about a mother leaving her kids inside of a stolen car. She left them in there for an hour while she's inside of a mall shopping to not pay. So she's in there shoplifting while kids are out there in a the vehicle alone. And what happens in that car is that car catches fire, is engulfed. It's an inferno going on in that car. And as these kids work to try to find their way of getting out, luckily one of the kids knew how to hit the locks to open and get out. And then also with Good Samaritan seeing what's going on to go over there and assist the children as well. And then the mother comes out. Now, they end up finding out that this car is stolen when she's at the hospital and that she had multiple other warrants. And they think what caused this fire was this idiot of a mother leaving these car, these kids inside this car um, with lighters, with, with uh, uh, dev you know, devices to spark a fire. You know, kids see lighters or matches, they play with them. And that ultimately, they lit something and it ended up catching. And that's what you got the result of. And this woman should never be allowed to get these kids back. And that's going to be a hard one uh, to just take kids away. Their, their their love for their mother is their love, but their safety with this woman who's making all the wrong mistakes in life, um, they're going to have to take these kids away from this chick, and this chick's going to have to get her damn life in order and, and get an understanding of right and wrong and what you're here for. You ain't setting the proper examples. Uh, I got no sympathy for this bra, and that's some real shit. She need to get her shit together. Ain't no hatred towards her, but I just keep it real and keep it extra funky on my opinion. These are just my opinions. Ain't it, ain't an expression of how the world should feel. These are my views. Y'all can have y'alls. But she's a piece of shit. And I think any parent who acts like a piece of shit when having children, if you're a piece of shit without kids, you change that shit when you have them. But uh, peep the news story about this foul-ass bro who was somebody's child, somebody's relative. And you better keep it funky with this chick. She realizes what she need to get in order. Check this shit. There was a car, um, I don't know, somehow is on fire outside in the parking lot at Dillard's. Um, and there was two kids and a mom. And a mom. We now have the 911 calls from this car fire at the Oviedo Mall. A mother is accused of leaving her two young children inside while she was shoplifting. And on top of that, police say that car was stolen. Yeah, you can see the video behind us. The fire starts inside the car, of course, and that inferno grows fast. It actually blows the windows out. And Fox 35's Connor Hansen joins us live from the mall today. So Connor, you've been listening to all these 911 calls. What have you heard so far? Well, John, all of those callers obviously very alarmed to see such a huge fire that close to the Dillards behind me. Luckily, somebody was able to get to those two kids before things got much worse. And now it's those children's mother who is inside the store at the time who's facing an arson charge. Now, the camera on a nearby car in this parking lot caught a close-up view of that sedan going up in flames. Police say a two- and four-year-old were left in the car for up to an hour while their mother went inside a allegedly to shoplift. We're told one of the children was able to open one of the car doors, and that's when a good Samaritan saw them and got them out. The kids were okay, but had minor burns. When the mother, Alicia Moore, went to the hospital with the two kids, police realized she had warrants for other crimes. Now she's also being charged with child neglect and arson. She's being charged with the arson because she did leave the kids alone in the car with some sort of uh, lighter matches. I don't know what it was that set the car on fire, but the children are her responsibilities. All right. So there you have it. Mother Alicia Moore, 24 years old. Homegirl, it's time for you to get your life in order and, and correct this shit. But that's all I got, folks. Peace.